Hello friends, today we're going to read the story Ish by Peter H. Reynolds. You might remember he's the same author of Sky Color, the story we read a couple days ago, and The Dot, the story we read at the beginning of the school year. So we're going to read Ish and see what our story is about. And here's our friend. Ramon loved to draw. Here's our friend Ramon. Anytime, anything, and anywhere. One day, Ramon was drawing a vase of flowers. His brother Leon leaned over his shoulder. Leon burst out laughing. What is that? he asked. Ramon couldn't even answer. He just crumpled up the drawing and threw it across the room. He looks very angry. I think the color red is representing his anger as well. Leon's laughter haunted Ramon. He kept trying to make his drawings look right, but they never did. Have you ever drawn something and you don't think it looks right? Let's see what happens. After many months in many crumpled sheets of paper, Ramon put his pencil down. I'm done. Looks like he's giving up. Marisol, his sister, was watching him. What do you want? He snapped. I was watching you draw, she said. Ramon sneered. I'm not drawing. Go away. Marisol ran away, but not before picking up a crumpled sheet of paper. Hey, come back here with that. Ramon raced after Marisol up the hall and into her room. He was about to yell, but fell silent when he saw his sister's walls. He stared at the crumpled gallery. It looks like these are all of Ramon's old drawings that he didn't think were right. This one is one of my favorites, Marisol said, pointing. That was supposed to be a vase of flowers, Ramon said, but it doesn't look like one. Well, it looks like a vase-ish, she exclaimed. Hmm. Vase-ish? Ramon looked closer. Then he studied all the drawings on Marisol's walls and began to see them in a whole new way. They do look ish, he said. So they look kind of like he, what he was trying to draw. Maybe a little more abstract, not realistic. Let's find out. Ramon felt light and energized. Thinking ishly allowed his ideas to flow freely. He began to draw what, whatever he felt, loose lines, quickly springing out without worry. Looks like he's making abstract art. Ramon once again drew and drew the world around him. Making an ish drawing felt wonderful. A tree-ish, a house-ish, a boat-ish, afternoon-ish, a fish-ish, a sun-ish. All of them look kind of like real things but using different colors or shapes or lines, more abstract. Ramon realized he could draw ish feelings too. Peace-ish, silly-ish, excited-ish. His ish art inspired ish writing. He wasn't sure if he was writing poems, but he knew they were poem-ish. One spring morning, Ramon had wondered a wonderful feeling. It was a feeling that even ish words and ish drawings could not be captured. He decided not to capture it. Instead, he simply savored it. And there he is relaxing. And Ramon lived ishly ever after. That's the end of our story, friends. I hope you're inspired to draw something ishly in abstract artwork with lines and designs, lots of colors just like our friend Ramon. Have an awesome day, friends. Happy creating.